Hi all, this is Steve Miley, the Market Chartist on behalf of ForexFraud.com and we're now going to take a look at both the New Zealand dollar and the Australian dollar, both versus the US currency and here versus the US dollar and looking for a still bullish intermediate term theme, particularly with New Zealand dollar through the rate cut decision we had last week um, on Thursday to push above the July peak at 73.24 up to 73.40. That shifted the intermediate term theme back to bullish. We've got this bull trend that's been running for the last year, accelerating higher through this year and particularly from June. We did negate that bullish theme in here with the sell-off that we saw in mid-July but re-energizing that bull theme with the 73.40 new peak in here above the July peak at 73.24 and bigger picture upside threat for higher targets now at 73.96 74.13 maybe up towards 75.64 so bigger picture we're looking higher and um, going into um, into the second half of August potential though for a little setback early this week given the sell-off that we saw um, through Friday um, looking at the Australian dollar similar setup in here a bullish theme not yet clearing the, pre the peak here earlier this year um, back from April at 78.35 but again last week pushing significantly above the peak in here from July um, into August, reinforcing the intermediate term bullish theme up through 77.19, leaving upside threat now up to the high for the year at 78.35 and maybe even higher targets than that going into the second half of August. Again, a setback on Friday, leaving a negative tone in here to begin the week, but we're certainly looking for support to try and hold and then for a rebound. This has been Steve May, the Market Chartist, on behalf of ForexFraud.com, and I wish you a great trip.